Here we go with the same problem that we solved with the TI-36X Pro. At the time I could not figure out how to get it to work on the HP Prime, but one of you very helpful commenters, I'll put the name on the screen and so that person gets credit. I knew better than to fight with the calculator. Turns out it's a known bug. If you enter the equation, like it looks, you'll get an error. So let's just do that. We'll go in here. If you type it in this way and you hit OK, everything seems good, but when you go to solve this by hitting number, both variables come up, which is already odd, and if you put in, that incidentally is the correct answer from a previous computation I did. So let's say we just put in 10 and then tell it to solve. It says bad guesses. And no matter what I do, it, I get this bad guesses. So I guess I'm not very good at guessing. All right, well, it turns out that's true, but that's not what's going on here. What's going on, so I hit symbol to get back to this, is that when you enter it, so let's do this, we'll edit this. When you enter it, you need to put parentheses around everything. Um, what is happening, what is going wrong with this right here, this original one I typed here, hold on, is somehow the parser is seeing the x equals 5 and that's throwing everything off. It's not realizing that this entire expression is equal to 5. I don't know why. It's a known bug that supposedly HP is addressing at some point. Let's put it in the right way. That's the key, to put those parentheses. When we enter it this way, I'm going to tell it I want to solve this one. I'm going to hit number. Notice I checked, oops, I checked the box on E2, and I'm going to hit, I don't think it has to be highlighted, hit number. So I'm going to hit solve. And it did the hourglass for just like maybe a second there, and there's our answer. So, in conclusion, this calculator can definitely solve that um, integral problem where the upper bound is unknown, or the upper limit, whatever the right term is for that. It has no problem doing it. The TI-36 took more than three minutes, I think closer to four minutes to solve it. This thing's doing it. With a worse guess, it's doing it in a matter of one second or so. All right, take care, and I'll see you next time. Adios.